Hi, I'm Celeste and welcome to Find Your Purple. Well, it's early this morning because I've got a lot of appointments today and I wanted to go ahead and get my video going because it's day nine and video every day in the month of April and I didn't want to miss a day. Um, I mentioned the other day that my car battery went dead when I was out with a client and I had to call one of my daughters to come and give me a jump and then the next day I went into the shop and had to get a new battery. Well, this morning I looked at my phone and I hadn't had it plugged in all night and I noticed it was very low battery juice. And I thought, well, wouldn't that be nice to have a spiritual battery gauge in my house so I knew when my faith was getting low. Because with the cell battery, when you see it's getting low, you just plug it into the source and you know it's going to fill up again. Same thing with spiritual battery. Your spiritual life isn't going to stay full unless you're feeding it, unless you're keeping plugged into the source. So I just thought I would toss it out there to make sure you keep an eye on that gauge. It's not a handy dandy one on the wall or the mirror, but you got to know in your heart, are you pumped up? Do you have enough juice to keep going? Um, are you reading the Bible every day? Are you praying? Are you talking to God in the car? And again, praying can be just as easy as saying, oh, thank you, God, for this beautiful day, or, and acknowledging God um, when good things happen, and reminding yourself that everything comes from God. So you just have to keep plugged into that source on a regular basis, or your spiritual battery is going to go dead, just like my cell phone. And that's it for today. So as always, grab your cup of tea, sit back, and let's start sharing. Until next time, bye-bye.